School football today. Chevrolet made their eight man debut against Yarmouth. The Stags would lead from the start in this one. Quarterback Richard Trumbull is going to roll out, find Brett Bogosian. 12 yard touchdown here. After the Chevrolet defense made a big stop, Marshall Fowler takes the pitch, brings it down the sidelines. Nobody's going to catch up with him. Break it free for a huge 85 yard running touchdown. Put the Stags up 14 0. Fowler had three touchdowns in the game. Then in the second quarter, Matthew Fogg, he's going to take the handoff here, gets to the outside, stretches this one 72 yards for the score. Jeffers wins with a final score of 54 to 8. Down the road at Deering, the Rams hosting Biddeford. Biddeford taking the lead in the second quarter. That's when Wally Tibbetts is going to throw it high and deep downfield to Charlie Bedider for the 54 yard touchdown, making it 8 to 7. Deering going to run this one and nobody's going to catch up. They're going to answer in the second quarter, though. Quick drive here. Jacob Landry goes over the middle. Bryson Wolfhart bringing it into the end zone. A 24-yard touchdown. Biddeford holding away, though, for the 36-14 win. In Wyndham, the Eagles take it on Brunswick. Wyndham marches the field in their opening possession here. Tate Chork finishes it off with a short touchdown. It's going to make the score 7-0 Eagles. Then it was the special team's turn to make a big play. They block the punt here. Alex Yaton scoops it up, takes it in. Earning six points on the return there to extend the lead 14-0 for Wyndham. Then in the second quarter, the defense forces a fumble. Ezra Foster picks it up and goes in for the score. Final score here, Wyndham 47-8. Freeport making its Class D debut against Madison after a scoreless first quarter. Falcons got the offense going in the second. Nick White finishes off the drive with a short touchdown. Then in the closing minutes of the half, Tony Casal goes up the middle. A 15-yard touchdown run here. Got to shake off the defender. Freeport leading 27-0 in the fourth quarter. In 